Hello everyone, I hope you're doing very well. Today we're in the F16C and we've just had the preliminary IFF functionality added, which is great. We can finally start using this in missions in BVR combat. So on our F10, we've got myself and RC here and a whole host of hostiles in front of us. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two of them, which is if you like the two middle rear ones, this TU-95 and this F-15C are friendly. These guys here are all hostile. So with this initial functionality, we have nothing on the HUD yet. Everything is done through the FCR down here. So we're gonna unpause. The first thing we're gonna do is go to our IFF backup panel here on the left console. It is imperative we ensure that our master control is in either low or norm for this current early access IFF to work. FCR up here, I'm just going to zoom out, make sure it's soy obviously with the square around it, if not then you're going to use DMS aft. Here are our various contacts and there's two ways that we can do the IFF and it's a transponder request. First is TMS left short, so that just means press and hold TMS shortly and uh, let go uh, and we get scan there and it's going to scan everything within this area and anything that comes up with a transponder response a mode 4 transponder response as friendly will show as a green circle nothing showed there so we're going to wait and we're going to do it again in a minute let's do it again tms left short as we call it and that guy's shown as a mode 4 squawk so that's friendly and a guy here who's not invisible yet is giving us a transponder response as well so those are our two with the scan it does everything within the current scan limits the next way of line of sight mode where it just sends if you like a small beam of transponder request out and it will choose that azimuth depending on our cursor location so let's just say we want to send them out here and to do this we're going to press and hold tms for one second and release so we're pressing tms left now and letting go you can see you've got los line of sight and it's got that guy there it does have we're not sure of the limits in terms of the threshold but it goes slightly left and right of this cursor here and we're going to go do this out here press and hold tms for a second and release tms left and LOS there, you see it's picked up that guy there. So you can see the transponder response stays on while the scan or line of sight symbol is here. Also notes that this works with SAM mode lock. If I were to say lock this guy here, TMS up, that's locked in SAM. I can now do a TMS left short and we can have scan and you can see it works there. Also, if I'm in an SCT lock, so TMS forward again, I've now got this guy in an STT lock, I'm gonna do TMS left short for scan and you can see it's come up. I'm going to try TMS long just out of interest in STT so that was TMS long and that works as well and that's how you do it. Nothing in the HUD at the moment but that will do for now. At least we know what we've got locked in SAM, what we've got shown in scan and what we've got locked in STT. We can now IFF.